morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you are in this wonderful world that we're on. Uh, it's January and we aren't messing about. Uh, we've got a signing in. Struber is he's there, he's kicking backsides, he's pulling phone calls and we've picked up our first January signing of 2020 and I don't think it'll be the last either. Now I saw reports yesterday that the reason, because everyone were like, Struber seemed to rush off after the game. I mean, to be fair, I wanted to get off home, but Struber's got work to do. And the rumours, what I saw, is they were flying, um, they were going abroad to, to get some deals done from his former club, Wolfsburger AC, which our new signing is from, uh, Marcel Ritzmeier. Now, again, like in the summer, I'm not going to sit here and say I know this guy, because I don't, uh, if you are. If you do know him, then fair play to you. Uh, but no, I've I'd never heard of him. Uh, midfielder who can operate pretty much across the whole diamond. Um, very versatile. Uh, well experienced. Over 200 games under his belt. 26 years of age. Remember that. Um, which is always, yeah, it's strange. I think it's been needed. We know it's been needed. A uh, bit of players with a uh, bit older. I mean, 26 is not old for a footballer, but Barnsley seem to think 26, you're virtually retired, and that's not the case. He signed a two-and-a-half-year deal, which ain't bad either. I know we're dishing out four-year contract in the, uh, in the summer. Uh, maybe this could be a... Mm, will not dish four year contracts out because some might not work out as well as thought but delighted that we got the, the signing done uh, really delighted it was expected there were rumours going round on Twitter yesterday rumours going round on Twitter today and it's finally come through that he has signed uh, just delighted overall that you know we've got somebody on board another midfielder so that's going to make the midfield interesting um I do hope that uh, it isn't um, him coming in because certain ones are leaving, uh, ones that we don't want to leave anyway. But I think your midfielders now who aren't necessarily getting a look in at all will probably be uh, offloaded off the wage bill, I would uh, I would say. And listen, it it's, makes sense. There's no point in them being here at the club if they're just going to not even want the bench, you know, and they're going to take the wages and... So I think that makes sense. Uh, but no, uh, really, really happy. He's played in the Europa League as well, which is, uh, you know, a bit good experience in there. He's meant to be really highly rated, you know. Played with, played under Struber at uh, Wolfsburger. And I think that's what um, uh, Struber's going to do. He's going to raid their football team. Because uh, I, I have seen rumours about another two players coming, a full-back as well. Um so it's going to be interesting this January transfer window, guys. It really, really is. Uh, I'm I'm just delighted that, that that somebody's on board and we're uh, here to talk about it, really. Uh, but I think there will be outgoings, but I think there'll be more incomings as well. Um, so it's not it's nice to see that this lad's coming in and you know Struber rates him highly. He says he can play number eight role, number six, and number ten, and he can even even operate at left back, which is uh, that, that that's really versatile. If we did need that. So, yeah, happy with that, guys. Um, I'm going to read you a bit on what's uh, been said about him. Uh, he just tw turned 27 in April as well, so there's that as well. Uh, he's represented Austria at under-16s, under-17s, under-18s, under-19s and under-21s level. Uh, Gerard Struber moved quickly to secure a player that had played 18 times for former club Wolfsburger AC this season, scoring twice and assisting four times. So that's not too bad. And Struber's had this to say that uh, um, Marcel is a special player and will offer us more options for positions in the diamond. He can play in what I would call the number 8, the 6 and 10. He's, uh, he's a player with experience and high uh, technical skills and is also quick. So I'm very happy he's chosen to play for Barnsley FC. Marcel will help uh, for me. Uh, Marcel will help for me and our team. Also our fans, he will be a good player for the club. Uh, and Marcel's spoken out uh, with this saying, I'm really happy to sign for Barnsley FC and to play in England. I have, I have played for eight and a half years in the Netherlands and also in Austria and also the Europa League so I can bring some experience to the team. I have a good relationship with Gerard and Max. I know 
I know them as trainers and they know me as a player. The way they want to play fits me very well. I am happy to work with them. Um, so yeah, that it's all positive, you know, it's all positive. And if Gerard Struber's got somebody from his former team, it, it does show, you know, that um, he, he definitely rates him, he's a player that he wants. So that's always nice to see as well. So I'm delighted on behalf of Struber for getting this signing in and, of course, um, the board as well, if, they, if they're working. I'm sure they'll all be working together. Um, yeah, I just hope that the key players are staying and that's that's the big thing. The key players stay at the football club. Um, and we can't really we can't really ask ask for any more than that, really. Uh, can't really ask for them any more. We do need a couple more players in, but I, like I said, I'm sure that we will do. But just happy that the, we've got a signing in and I'm really looking forward to seeing because what I've read about him and the stats and everything, he looks a very positive player. So looking forward to seeing him. Hopefully he'll feature against Huddersfield. He might even get. He might even start. And I'm one of these. Me start him, start him. You know, uh, let him make an impact. Uh, so yeah, really happy guys. Let me know your thoughts, of course. And thank you so much for watching. Stick around as well. We've got quite a few videos today. There might be more transfer videos, but also we've got the FA Cup draw for the fourth round um, because we got through yesterday. So we're going to see who we get. That we'll be going live for that. Maybe not not as soon as the programme starts, but we'll we'll go live at some point. So thank you so much for watching us, guys. Uh, let me know your thoughts again. And uh, if you're new to Tax TV, subscribe. Any 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 fans out there football in the footballing world who does know um, this lad, let us know what uh, we can expect from him. And as again, thank you so much for watching. All the best, you Reds.